out for a walk on the West Vancouver seawall here. Nice sunny afternoon. This is one of my favorite places to come to, to go for a walk. Come with me. Living here on the West Coast, we are blessed with all kinds of interesting places to go for a walk or a hike. This place is one of my favorites. I may not be a rich person, but coming here makes me feel rich. And I'm not talking about the material wealth that you see everywhere, all over this place. There's all kinds of trendy shops, bars, and restaurants in this neighborhood. You almost feel like you're in Southern California. But the real glory of this place is the natural beauty. And the parking is usually free. The West Vancouver Centennial Seawall is a roughly two kilometer pathway from Ambleside Park in the east to Dunderave Park in the west. Here is the view from the top of Grouse Mountain looking down on it. This gives you an idea of where it is. This place is a food lover's paradise and a gardener's paradise. Throughout the summer there's arts and crafts festivals, outdoor concerts and shows that happen at Ambleside Beach. Today is a nice hot summer day, the tide is out. When the tide moves in, the waves can really make big splashes against the rocks, so you might get wet. If you come here at the right time, you'll see all kinds of ships. Personal watercraft, cruise ships, cargo ships, starships, What the hell was that? Right now we're in the middle of the COVID-19 pandemic. I don't know if you can hear that, but everybody's in their apartment windows banging pots. They do that every night at seven o'clock. A show of solidarity for all the doctors. Or maybe they're tired of being stuck in their apartments and they can't wait to get back outside. I can't say I blame them. The park benches here all have memorials on them. They're a great place to sit and watch the world go by. The real estate here is probably the most expensive in Canada. This apartment building looks out of place. It should be in California or something. The numbers here are down right now. Not as many people as you would expect. If you travel along the path west of Dunderave, there's lots of short trails that lead down to hidden beaches. Just be mindful of the tide coming in. Even on cloudy days, this is a nice place to come to. You might spot some wildlife. During a storm, the waves will push logs right onto the walkway. Over in Dunderave is the Beach House, a centuries-old heritage house converted into a high-end restaurant. You see wildlife here too. There's an eagle up on the top of that tree being swarmed by a bunch of crows. At sunset, you cast a long shadow. This place becomes really pretty at twilight. During this time of COVID-19 isolation, it's been really depressing for all of us. So let's all try to be a little nicer to each other. I've noticed people are getting more agitated lately, especially if you watch the evening news. So if you feel that way, come out to a place like this and go for a walk. It'll do you some good. Until next time, ciao.